welcome back to my channel. So first of all, I'm sorry I haven't been uploading for a while and that's because I was very, very busy with work. Um, I'm sorry, that's all I can say, but I'm about to change that. And today we are going to talk about the new Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. Um, this is not a foundation. It looks like a foundation. When you open it, it has this like very huge wand, but what it says on the website is that it is going to give you a lot of glow, um, like a highlighter, uh, perfecting properties of your favorite digital filter. Well, first of all, the name has Hollywood in it and it has a filter and flawless. I mean, who doesn't want that? So what I am going to do is I am going to apply the product on its own on my left side of my face and then on the right side I am going to apply first a foundation and then apply this baby on top of it. I asked people who work for Charlotte Tilbury what it is. Well, again, it is not a foundation. Um, you can use it on its own but it's not going to give you coverage. I think I already said that but you know, who cares. So. Without further ado, let's just jump right into the video and let's see what this baby is all about. Okay, let's apply. I am going to take some of this onto the back of my hand. I think that's more sanitizing than applying the wand on my face. I don't like that. By the way, I am in the shade 5. This is more than enough. It is not extremely liquid, but it has a lot of glow in it. Let's see. I think I have way too much product. Okay, um, first of all, don't use so much. Because... Alrighty, and I'm going to blend it out using a beauty blender. They said it's not going to give you coverage, but why does it look like I have... Oh, that's glowing! Girl! Wait! Holy crap, that's pretty... I mean... I don't know, but I, of course, it is not a lot of coverage, but to me, it's enough. And that glow. Oh, that is so pretty. Okay, so a left side without foundation, but just the product on its own. I can definitely see me wearing this during summer, like no foundation, just this product. Um, it is giving me a little bit of coverage, gotta be honest with you, and... I know where people who are looking for coverage do not buy this because it's, it's very, very small. But to me, it is perfect. I like skin like this. I do love a good cake face, but most of the time I like to wear it like this. And this is just pretty. Alrighty, let's do the other side. I am going to apply the foundation first. This is their Youth Boost youth boosting perfect skin foundation light wonder and i am in the shade eight medium there we go okay so foundation is on let's now apply this baby on top of it not taking too much like i did before but just you know You guys, I don't know what to say. This looks so pretty. Holy crap. I'm going to zoom you guys in because you need to see this. Okay, so this is the side without foundation. So just the product on its own. I have a little baby here. Oh, well, but that is... I think perfect for summer. That looks beautiful. It's very lightweight, extremely lightweight. It's it's glow in a bottle. It's almost like J Lo in a bottle. You know, not that 
you look like her because nobody does and everybody wants that. But that's not the point. It is perfection. I like this. The other side, this is my favorite side. And I think this is the way you're supposed to use this product. First foundation and then add this product to give you that glow and honey. Hmm. Oh, wait. I have like kinds of things on my face. I didn't have that yesterday. Anyway, honey, this baby is gorgeous. I mean, I'm not lying, right? I like both sides. I think this is a perfect summer product. Alrighty, you guys. I don't even know if a review is necessary because I actually told you everything during the video. Um, I'm going to try to keep it short and this product is amazing. I like it. Now I have everything on my face, like a little bit of contour, some highlighter and some concealer. I don't see a, a very big difference, like the left side, no foundation and foundation. Maybe that's because, um, how do I say that without being, you know, look at me. I'm pretty pleased about how my skin looks. I think that I do not need a lot of coverage because I don't have a lot of things to cover. I do have some like spots on my face, um, I don't know the English term. You know what I mean? And I'm actually fine with that. You know, I like it when my foundation feels like skin. It's a little bit, you know, see-through. I like that. First, I thought that with foundation, it was going to be my favorite side, but now I think I like this side even better because it's glowy, it's luminous, it's extremely lightweight, and that's what I like, except for the little bumps I have all over my face. I don't know what that is. But if you are looking for something that's gonna ride up your life, this baby will be your favorite. And I think especially during summer because most of the people do not like to apply a lot of foundation because you want your skin to breathe and with heavy foundation, that's kind of difficult. But if you do need coverage or you want to have more coverage, apply your own foundation, your even the Estee Lauder Double Wear, because to me that's like the most full coverage foundation there is. It's extremely matte or MAC Studio Fix Fluid and then apply this baby on top of your face. If you have oily skin, be careful. I applied this product all over my face. What I would do if I had oily skin or my client would have oily skin, I would apply a matte foundation and then only on like the highest points of the face, like where you normally would apply highlighter, that's where I would apply this product or even mix it a little bit with that foundation and then set it with some powder on your face. So yeah, guys, that was my review and application of the new Charlie Tilbury Hollywood Flawless filter. I don't. It's a long name, okay? Don't hate me. Let me know if you tried it. Let me know your opinion. What do you prefer without foundation or with foundation? Uh, let me know down in the comment below. If you like this video, I would appreciate it if you would give this video a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos, and like I said, I promise there will be more videos, um, please subscribe. So again, thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you soon.